It's time for the Illini update. The football team fell to the Minnesota Gophers on Saturday in a 17-3 loss at home. Coming up, the team will host the Boilermakers on Saturday, November 17th at Memorial Stadium in their final home game of the season. The men's basketball team emerged victorious over Colgate in their season opener on Friday with a final score of 75-55. Senior guard Brandon Paul led the Illini in scoring with 20 points on the night. The win was coach John Gross's first with the Illini. Coming up, the team will head to Honolulu, Hawaii to take on the University of Hawaii on Friday, November 16th. They will then head to Lahaina, Hawaii to compete in the Maui Invitational from Monday, November 19th to Wednesday, November 21st. The women's basketball team crushed Concordia at home on Tuesday in their final exhibition game of the season with a final score of 120-29. to Sophomore forward Taylor Tuck led the Illini in scoring with 20 points on the night. The Orange and Blue earned an 84-52 victory over Evansville this Sunday. Amber Moore led the team with 19 points and added four rebounds, four assists, and one steal in her 33 minutes of play. Coming up, the team will host Bradley on Thursday, November 15th, and Cleveland State on Sunday, November 18th at Assembly Hall. The volleyball team went on the road this past weekend to take on some Big Ten competition. On Thursday, the team lost to the Nittany Lions in State College in three sets. Senior middle blocker Aaron Johnson led the team with eight kills and six blocks in the match. On Saturday, the team traveled to Columbus where they fell just short to the Buckeyes in five sets. Redshirt freshman Allie Stark matched her career high in kills with 13 on the night. Coming up, the team will return home to Huff Hall to face Michigan State on Friday, November 16th, and Michigan on Saturday, November 17th. The men's cross-country team placed fourth of 29 teams in the NCAA Midwest Regional in Springfield, Missouri on Friday. Senior Hunter McCall and grad student Janice Topher qualified for the 2012 NCAA Championship. Coming up, the Orange and Blue will compete in the NCAA Championship in Louisville, Kentucky on Saturday, November 17th. The women's cross-country team competed in the NCAA Regional in Springfield, Missouri on Friday, placing ninth out of 31 teams. Redshirt freshman Alyssa Schneider and senior Courtney Yeager earned all region honors. Coming up, the team will compete in the NCAA championships in Louisville, Kentucky on Saturday, November 17th. The soccer team advanced to the second round of the NCAA tournament after a 3-0 penalty kick shootout against Mizzou in the first round. The teams were tied 1-1 at the end of 110 minutes of play. Coming up, the Orange and Blue will compete in the second round of the NCAA tournament. The wrestling team competed at the Harold Nichols Cyclone Open on Saturday in Iowa. Coming up, the Orange and Blue will compete at the Lindenwood Open on Saturday, November 17th in St. Charles, Missouri. The swimming and diving team fell to Illinois State on Friday in Normal with a final score of 157 to 143. Sophomore Allison Merrick broke two school records, one in the 50 back and one in the 100 back. Coming up, the Orange and Blue will